Hello everybody, my name is Connor McGrath, and my two monologues I'll be doing today, the first one will be Much Ado About Nothing, the part of Benedict, and the second one will be from The Pillow Man, the part of Katurian. <clears throat> they say the lady is fair. Well, just so, I cannot reprove it. And wise. <laughs> but for loving me, by my troth, it is no great addition to her wit. Well, no, no great argument to her folly, for I will be horribly in love with her. Oh, I might have remnants of wit broken against me because I've railed so long against marriage, but doth not the appetite alter? Hmm? A man loves the meat of his youth that he cannot endure at his age. Shall quips and sentences and these paper bullets of the mind awe a man from the career of his humor? No! Uh, the, the world must be people! The, when I said I would die a bachelor, I, I did not think... I should live till I were married. Hey, you know what I say? I say if you have a political axe to grind, if you have a political, uh, what do you call it? Just go write a fucking essay, you know? I will know where I stand. I say keep your left wing this, keep your right wing that, and tell me a fucking story. <laughs> Um, uh, a wise man once told me, uh, the first duty of the storyteller is to tell a story. And I believe in that wholeheartedly. The, the first duty of the storyteller is to tell a story. Or is it the only duty? I, I can't remember. Anyways, the point is, that's what I do. I, I tell stories, no axe to grind, no political anything to grind. And that's why I can't see, if, if that's why you brought me here, I, I can't see what that reason might be. Unless something political came in, or, or something seemed political came in by accident. But if so, tell me where it is. I'll take it right out, you know? Fucking burn it! <laughs> you know? <clears throat> um, you, um, you know what I'm saying? Thank you very much. Once again, my name is Conrad Grath.